What is up guys? Welcome to the Big Unbox where we do that small tech and today I am back with another Say it with me guys Big unboxing for you for the OnePlus 5 and we're back at it with another tempered glass screen protector As always we're looking for that perfect one and we won't stop until we find it So this one was called Extreme Guard I'll put up the link in the video description. Um, I've never really heard of them. Uh, I got a suggestion in the comment section, so I looked it up. There is a 70% off coupon that's on the website. So save 70, that gets you 70% off. The actual screen protector itself is $29.99, but then you do get on top of that 70% off with that code. And again, that's why that's active. So check it out if it's something you're interested in. I'll put up the link in the video description. Hopefully this is the one we've been looking for, guys. You just never know. So packaging-wise, it looks a little bit, little bit different than the ones we've tested in the past. Screen protectors, Spartan Shield, real tempered glass. And this is, again, this is called Extreme Guard. 9H, super strong hardness. HD fingerprint, anti-fingerprint. And it says bubble-free as well. So we'll check it out. What we'll do is, you know, what we'll do, we'll put it to the case test. We'll do the little review and see if it's something we've been looking for, guys. So let's go ahead and check it out here. Packaging-wise, pretty minimal. So, you know, retails for 30 bucks, which is definitely pretty expensive. But with that code, that 70% off, that's a pretty good deal. And I, I think there's free shipping, too. So nothing really to the packaging. See what we got little instruction guide one two three four and we'll obviously do the usual test to see if it's full adhesive let's see what we're getting the packaging here so basically just get it one microfiber cloth and it's actually not even that it's kind of brittle so i will probably won't be using this but put it to the side so you really don't get nothing else with it but if it doesn't matter if it's actually the one we'll be looking for right guys it doesn't matter at all so this is the tempered glass and it looks like it's going to be short but not crazy short so maybe okay you can tell it's gonna be short on the sides but one of the things that i do like it's clear around the edges so if it is short around the edges it's not gonna that you know that black line is not gonna get in the way of anything sometimes when you got that short ones with the black lines it's gonna affect the viewing angles and stuff like that this wouldn't at least so let's see pretty thin tempered glass not much else to it, it kind of looks like some of the other ones we've looked at but you can see the fingerprint sensor got the little cut out there so i'm going to put the video on pause we'll put this on we'll put it to the case test like we do guys hold tight maybe this is the one never know guys welcome back all right so we got the tempered glass screen protector put on this one is again the Extreme Guard. I'll put up the link in the video description. When you guys are looking at the website, when you put in the OnePlus 5, and you'll see a couple different options. You'll see a 999 screen protector. That's not the one I got. You'll see a Spartan tempered glass screen protector option. That's a second option for $29.99. That's the one I got. On their website, there's a save 70 coupon code. That saved a lot of cash. I think with shipping, it was like 13 bucks for this. You only get one, but I can say without a doubt, this is probably the closest we've been to finding a great one. I'll tell you why. It does look short and it's a little bit short, but it's full adhesive. You're not quite edge to edge protection, but even with it short, it's actually clear. So you're not having those black lines being distractive. I'll give you guys some angles of it. So you can see, this is a little bit short. So you can see a little bit of the screen bleed. But again, you're not having those black edges that's annoying and being distracting to you guys. So if you can get past that, this may be the way to go because it's full adhesive. It's not that, you're not going to get that rainbow effect. You don't see any micro dots on there. You see what I'm saying? There's no micro dots. So we're getting in the right direction at least guys and I can tell you by being a little bit short It's probably going to be compatible with most of these cases. We'll do the case test right now. Let's go and get to it Let's get to it 
go with the official bumper. You can see there's plenty of room to breathe on the edges. You can just squeeze all day. That's not popping off. Good to go. So I can tell you that all the official cases, it's going to be good to go. Let's go ahead and start knocking out some 2 d Here's a 2 d one. This one's going to be a dual layer case. We're just going to pop it right in. We're not even going to take out that inner layer. And you can see, good to go. It's got room around the edges. Not bad. We're definitely going the right direction for sure, guys. If this isn't perfect, I know it's not perfect because it's shorter, but it's probably the best that I've seen. And in terms of being compatible with cases, you can tell it's compatible with all these cases. And if you can get past that little shortness, price-wise, if you get that coupon code, not too bad a deal. Let's see what else we got. All right, so this one is the, all right, this is the caseology one we just checked out. So this is a heavy, heavy case. It's a dual layer case, just like that 2D one, and it's got some major lip protection. So let's check it out to see if it's compatible. Pops it into place, easy, no issues at all. You can see plenty of room to breathe, plenty of lip protection. So if you drop the phone, it's gonna hit that lip and not the screen anyways. But good to go there, so. As you guys can see, we shouldn't have any issues with these, but we're just gonna keep on knocking them out. I know you guys have lots of different cases. I get lots of requests, so bear with me. Everybody wants to see if it's compatible, which I understand, you know, you, you spend a lot of money for this phone. You finally want a tempered glass that actually is gonna protect your phone, so, and, your, and be compatible with your case. This the 2D is good. Let's see what else we got, guys. This one is the Pelosi. And I apologize if I can't remember the name of all these cases. We got too many. Pelosi, good to go. I mean, no issues. We'll just start getting to the, the big boys right now. We'll do like the speed in because I can tell you, I just feel like it's gonna be compatible with all these, so no issues at all. This is the speed in, I think ultra hybrid or something. And this one's got a major, major lip for a clear case. And as you can see, there's still room to breathe. You drop this, you are still got that big lip protecting it. Let's wipe it down, wipe it down. You guys have been patient with me. We're, look, we're trying to find the perfect one, and if this isn't the perfect one, we're at least headed in the right direction, guys. That's all I can say. Keep the suggestions coming. You know, We'll keep on looking, but as of right now, this is probably the best that I've seen. And again, it's a little bit short, but what can you do? So the OtterBox, another heavy hitter. I know everybody's looking for an OtterBox one that's compatible because of some crazy lip protection with the OtterBox. One of the probably bigger lips you'll see on a case. And as you can see, even with that big, huge, huge lip, you got room to breathe. It's not coming off. You drop that, you're good. Good to go. Plenty of room. Let's see what else we got here. A couple of these Spigens that always cause issues. The Rugged Armor. Good to go. Plenty of room to breathe. No issues at all. So this one has been 100% compatible with all these cases. Here's one more Spigen. For all the speaking boys out there, but trying to get the you know one that works for the speakings because we've had so many issues. I'm just throwing it right in there too. I'm not even, I'm not even being gentle with it. Good to go. Plenty of room. Let's see what else we got. I mean, a couple more guys. I mean, guys are all. You guys got all out of cases. All right, here's the Rhino Shield. This one's actually just going to be that thin bump around the edges. So if you guys got this screen protector this bumper and then you know a skin you're rocking the skins on the back you should be good to go that should be nice nice amount of protection for your one plus five okay so you can even see with this you're getting some lip protection plenty of room you pop a skin on the back that's some nice coverage right there all right let's do Let's do one more. Let's do the Beetle. 
Shout out to everybody that has the beetle. Let's check it out. We'll do the save the beetle for last because I can never get it off. <laughs> That's how we do. It. And if I miss one, I apologize. Let me know in the comments section. I'll test it out. I'm pretty sure you're good to go with it though. You should be good to go. I don't see this being an issue with any case. And again, I'll put up the link in the video description if you guys want to check it out. This may be the way to go. Now, if I could not struggle with getting this one in. All right. All right, so the Beetle Boys, let's see what we got, guys. It's not lined up perfectly, but you can see still room to breathe. Oh, it is quite, it's popping the Beetle a little bit. Oof. Hmm. All right, guys, I'm back. It actually did pop up the beetle somehow. I don't know how that happened. So I had to pause the video to take it out to see if uh, it messed up the screen, and it did just a little bit. So I don't know how that wouldn't be compatible with the beetle. Maybe just the way it was sitting. But with that said, it's compatible with all the rest of the cases. I would say this one's a hit, except for maybe the beetle. Check out all the rest of them. It should be good to go. Now the fact that it's not laying down right now because I popped that beetle on is driving me nuts, but maybe I at least found, found you guys something that works for you. So let me know what you guys think in the comment section. I would say this one's probably gonna be on the hit list. Let me know what you guys think, hit or miss. Hit the subscribe button, guys. We'll see you guys next time on the Big Unbox. We do it big, guys.